Hey teabags and what's going on? We're back on Steam once again looking at different types of games and I've got a crazy one for you again. Always I have a crazy one but yeah we are here and we are back again. I want to check you I want to show you this game out. It's called Spooky Men right? If you're already familiar with it I'm gonna go over the concept and you probably think why are we doing a normal type of game this time? There's something that's normal about it. There's something that's not normal about it. And you'll find out. You'll find out. So, Spooky Man. It's an early access survival PvP multiplayer. Um, multiplayer FPS thriller. Crafting action horror. Casual dark 3D first person. Combat. Quick time events. Simulation exploration. Demon. Sandbox. And cinematic game. Spooky Man is an online one to eight player cooperative survival horror game complete tasks and exorcists ex exorcisms the uh, male violent demon use your wits to distract the ghost and survive it attacks as you explore the haunted property can you make it out alive can you maybe you can but anyway spooky men um we're going to watch the video because I can actually show everything. There's no dicks, there's no vagines, uh, there's no the boobies and there's no, you know, asshole. There's none of that. It's just a normal, simple game. Look, is if you know demonologists or phasmophobia, it's similar to that. So we're going to watch this, ready? We're going to watch it. We're going to watch it, you know? Might, might turn it down a little bit. No, just, just a little bit. So as you can see, it's a normal game, you know? I know the screen's a bit uh, more open, but you know, it's fine. Yeah, you look here in your room. You, you got you got some. You got one bottle of red wine there. It looks like lovely red wine. You got a brain activity over there. Oh, it's a man. Oh, scary. Spooky men, guys. Spooky men. So you can play as characters, obviously. Uh, you got a green light over there. Spooky man. It's got nice nipples, pointy nipples. Complete tasks. The music is very fucking loud. I am going to turn that down. Okay. Use your... So, yeah, you can play as your ghost or, you know, you can play as the ghost or the uh, the humans, the survivors or the killers, as aka kind of like Dead by Daylight kind of thing. Uh, but there's like 4-4 four, for four, this like 4-4 four, four on a team, which is kind of cool. Um, and all that glorious stuff. You can turn off the power. You've got your, like, abilities, I guess. Um, it seems like a nice uh, niche game, right? Yeah, you know. Uh, it looks, it's very early access, you know, very, very early access. And there you go, I'll show you some pictures as well, you know, you know, you gotta look at some pictures, there you go, boom, 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 you know, doggy kitty, you know, and there you go. Now you're probably wondering, what is wrong with this game, Daniel, what is wrong with this game? Well, listen, this game I tell you, it's the cheapest game on Steam right now. It is the cheapest. Like, you could... Honestly, it is cheap. Do you want to see how cheap it is? Let me show you. There you go, guys. The cheapest game on Steam right now is literally a million. Upcoming big updates as well. Upcoming big updates. So, you know. Like, literally, if you want to buy this game right now, I wouldn't. I would wait for a sale, maybe 99% off sale, which will probably come eventually. I have no idea. Um, single player, online PvP, online co-op, and Steam achievements. You get Steam achievements. But yeah, Spooky Man. 999, like colon, whatever that is. 999.99. Yeah. Um, I don't know why. But... I, I, I apparently this game was cheap now this is what i've heard this game was cheap but then i don't know if this is true this is what i've heard of people this game was cheap people played it they gave it bad reviews because it was not good so the developer decided to put the price up to a million to stop people buying it but to see this on steam i am scared shall i tell you why i'm scared of this shit is because if someone sees this, they're going to be like, Wait a minute. Why can't my game be that price? 
I'm going to put mine up for two million. And so I bet you any money, some fucking idiot out there is like, oh, that's a cheap game. I'll buy that two million. Boom, jump. Tell you, I, fucking someone. Someone's going to do it. I bet someone's paid that price. And dude, if I made a game, put it for a million, I'll only need one seller and then I'll be a millionaire. Fuck it. Actually, no, I wouldn't. That's a lie because Steam will take some uh, profit off of that. And so I won't be a millionaire. So I have to sell two. So I gotta sell two. <laughs> Sake. Oh, uh, I just can't believe it. I really cannot believe it, to be honest. Um, I don't know what to say about it. I really don't know. But spooky men, there's a giveaway as well. Fucking hell! If I get, if I get the giveaway and get a code for it, can I sell that for a million? Yo, that that is good, right? Anyway, let's let's read the comments because we love the comments and all that glorious stuff. I'll tell you one thing. It is a very uh, unique kind of a game, though. Obviously, it's like Demonologies and Phasmophobia, but 1v8 one, one would be cool if you could go online and do all that. And, you know, you have four killers, uh, four uh, survivalists, and, you know, I guess, like, ghosts. It'll be, it'll be interesting. You could scare the other opponent. You know, you don't have to kill him. You could just play with your food, as you would say. Um... I don't know. Maybe it would be cool, but yeah, anyway. First thing we do is check how many people have got on this game. I don't think a lot, right? I don't think a lot of people have been playing this game at all. If someone's got five hours, I'll be happy. Okay, so... So this guy here... This guy here has got 101 hours on this game. Uh, on record. 5.3 hours at a review time. So let's see what he says. His name's 999. Just like the fucking price. 999. <laughs> this is ex uh, excellent. How my grandparents described how walking to school was for them back in the day. That's not excellent, is it? Ex uh, extra, extra. I can't fucking read. I'm sorry. A uh, 10 out of 10 game, but hey, he's talking about his grandparents. He's talking about the description, how walking to school was for them back in the day. I, I don't know what that means, but I, I, now my comment is, did he buy this game when it was 999? Wait, he's got four. Wait, what's this? You're, oh, you're a dang man you're a dank man xd you can't refund it anymore one million dollar dollars for a single game i'm rich <laughs> oh yo he's rich 999 is rich everybody just imagine you bought this game right i know i know i know this wouldn't happen but just imagine you bought this game for 10 pound yeah say if it was on sale their price they put it up for 999 you wouldn't if you refunded it it would be funny if you got the million but you wouldn't because you bought it for a ten dollars, so you would get the ten dollars back. But it would be funny if there was like I don't know a glitch happen and you got that million. Damn, I'll put that in the fucking stock market straight away. Yo, oh god. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. He's rich. He's rich. I can't. I can't. I can't do anything about that. This guy's rich as well, apparently. Imagine. Wait, I don't know why I said imagine. Light work. No reactions. Uh, reaction pain for this game. What the fuck? Fell asleep. Okay. I read that one. This game is fun with the homies. Yeah, I could see that. I can say it's worth the price. Can't wait for the, up uh, the coming update. Are they... <laughs> Are these trolls or something? I can say it's worth the price. I, I I don't see how it's worth the price there, my guy. <laughs> but okay. I love spooky my spooking my friends so goofy. Uh spooky. Uh okay. This was sent to Steam support for a refund. This game is absolutely trash. It cost 59 cents. It's not worth being on Steam platform. I would like to end my life after playing this shit. For 10 minutes, I have smiled into momentum of dis Oh, God. And pure depression. I will drink myself to sleep tonight and seek professional mental help. 
health as fuck. Oh, foot in the morning. With love, Isaac. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to... No wonder he kind of put the price up to the game. Dev was in chat while I was streaming, giving us live updates based on our feedback in real time. 100 out of 10. Okay, I do like it when you play a game and it's an early access game and you play it and the devs are watching you stream and they're listening to you. I, I, can't, I do like that feedback. I think that feedback is very good. Very good. Okay, let's browse more. Okay. I, I, I just can't. Uh, I just, there's so many reviews though. This game is death worth it. 10 out of 10 needs more of that bob. The Bob, the Bob, or the Boop, the Bob, has a lot of uh, potential fun to play. The devs is super nice. We just need more Bob. Who the fuck is Bob? Is he the ghost? <laughs> this is a good game. Clearly instructions, the menu and graphics are well polished and playing with friends is a good laugh. Got to play with owner A out of 10. So what I'm hearing here, right? What I'm hearing is the developer is nice. The developer is actually trying to listen to make the game good. But some people obviously did not like the game. So they review bombed it or said it was very bad, blah, blah, blah. And I understand that. Everybody's got an opinion. That's great. But he's trying to listen. Maybe this is his first ever game. And there is people that like it. The people that are interested. And the developer is listening. The owner and he's trying to implement these on the update. So maybe for the kindness of his heart, I have a feeling it was cheap and then he put the price up to stop people from getting it so he could update it more. So maybe in a couple of months, I will check this game back again and maybe it'll be normal price again. Who knows? Because I don't know. But hey, whoever plays, whoever plays this game who has it, yo, you've got a fucking expensive game right now. <laughs> So there you go. Uh, hats off to you. Uh, also, the developer who made this game. Keep going, my guy. You know, you've got a dream. You've got a game there. People obviously do love this game base. And also, I would love more games like this. The re I've never played it. But the reason is, there's not many horror games that are like where you could play with your homies or your girlfriend and stuff like that. So this would be an interesting game. You know, I don't know. Um... More games like this would be good. I know we got Demonologies, Phasmophobia, games like that. But hey, more games are merrier. And if he put the price up for that reason to stop people from getting it for now until he updates it, then I'm fine with that, to be honest. Um, So keep doing what you're doing, the dev, whoever you are, whatever your name is. And yeah, like I say, it's mixed reviews right now. So that's not bad. Like if it was mostly negative, I would understand more. But mixed is not bad. It's just orange, okay? It's like on a traffic light. But yeah, uh, product received for free. I would actually like to play this game. If the devs ever watch this uh, video, I would like to play this game. Check it out. You know, I'm not I'm not a guy that will say straight away if it's shit. I will say, listen, it's a good game. You've got a nice foundation. You've got a nice base. You just need to do this, this, this. And maybe add some more stuff that you want to do. I don't know. Like I say, I'm not going to say a game shit if it's not shit. Because I can't fucking make a game. Do you see me making a game? The probably game that I could play is fucking nothing. <laughs> I can't. I can't make a game. Uh, this game is actually really fun with friends, and I would highly recommend it. Usually, I do not have friends. Oh, bless him. Bless you. Um, uh, fell asleep. Uh, but yeah, like I say, an amazing horror game. I recommend a bit of a horror. A lot of thoughts. Perfect for horror game lovers. See. Perfect for horror game lovers. That's what I mean. That, that's what I mean right there. Perfect for horror game lovers right there. And uh, this game is spooky. I'll give it that I got a uh, good 77 minutes and in and played with the uh, owner of the game. 9 out of 10 just for how good the game is. Overall, but characters' graphics are a little meh. I recommend if you like games like Phasmophobia, Devour, or Ghost Ex Ex Exil. Um, yeah, so basically it's one of them type of games. Like I say, uh, mostly, I'm not going to lie, you, you could probably have a go at me, but mostly Devour, Demonologist, uh, Phasmophobia. 
the character design is kind of shitty not gonna lie uh so i wouldn't expect the character design on this one to be great i would love to see like a cartoony phasmophobia demonologist or something like that that would be pretty cool but then again i would understand that it won't be scary so it's got to be more and more realistic i don't know call me stupid i am but i don't know i, I love more color than darkness and grays and all that stuff i love color that's the main thing that i do i i just i just love color um but yeah like i say he's trying he's trying and you know he made he's made a game some people like it like you can see he's tr i have no idea what this picture is of no idea is that a cat in the middle no fucking clue i'm so confused on that but as you can see it to be honest from the from the screenshots it doesn't look that bad it just looks like phasmophobia or demonology like i'm i'm not kidding you it doesn't look that bad i'm i'm being honest with you yeah the characters always look in these games kind of like meh but it doesn't look that bad but oh well who can i say but there you go, guys. That has been Spooky Men. What do you guys think about the price tag? <laughs> I think it's funny and I think it's hilarious. But let me know what you teabags think. Thank you for watching another steamy weemy thing. And I'll see you guys next time on whatever I do. See you later, teabags. Bye.